there, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for being here today. My name is Joss, and if you love to talk about fragrance and perfume, you've come to the right place. I hope you'll consider subscribing, and I also hope you'll consider following me on TikTok and Instagram. On Instagram, I post a daily fragrance learning combo every day, and you can find me at joss.jane on both Instagram and TikTok. Today, I'm taking you on a little tour of my body care closet. So it's a lot. I'm just gonna start by saying that. <laughs> I realize it's a lot and it is probably more than we can use, but, but I do have a household of people here. So it's more than just me using these products. So my goal is to use all of them, of course. There's a little bit of a completionist in me. So there are a couple of different lines where I really wanted to have like the whole collection. So anyway, like I said, I post a layering combo every day on Instagram. Even though I don't always post the shower gels and the soaps and the body scrubs that go with my lotions and my perfumes and my body sprays, I do use them every day. So I do like a lot of variety and, and this is my hobby, it's fun, so. So here we are in the body care closet and we're gonna start with the hand soap. So I've, I've got a few of the Bath & Body Works hand soaps left and then I'm going to be moving to Costco because I have a bunch of Costco soaps I need to use up. I'll get to those later. <laughs> a little frustrating story. So we've got Island Papaya, Coconut Mint Drop. So this is an interesting one. This oddly reminds me of Santal 33 by Lolabo. I don't know why because Santal 33 doesn't have coconut or mint but this gives me like a really strong sandalwood vibe. So I really like this one. Sea salt and lime, champagne toast. Then just kind of a miscellaneous. I love cucumber and green tea nourishing body wash. This was just a miscellaneous that didn't fit anywhere because it's kind of big. I've got this Victoria's Secret Warm and Cozy Hand and Body Wash. I really love the Warm and Cozy scent. I think it's really, really pretty. It's kind of a berry and vanilla. Well, it says soft vanilla, toasted coconut, passion fruit. I guess that's what it is, but I love it. It's kind of a classic. This is the Body Shop Shower Gel in Love and Plums. It's a newer one from their vegan line, and I haven't obviously used this one. Then we've got the Bath and Body Works Moisturizing Body Washes. I really like these. This is a great formula. I've got Strawberry Pound Cake, Fairy Tale, Sunset Glow, and Cotton Candy Champagne from the Christmas Collection. And then I've got a Butterfly Body Scrub, and I've got an Ulta Cucumber Moisture Wash Body Wash. I just got this Vita Bath Coconut Noir Wash from Ulta. I think I just needed to get to free shipping, so I <laughs> thought I'd try that one. I've got quite a few of the Bath and Body Works shower gels. So I've got Sugar Cherry Crisp. This is an Ulta one actually in Sweet Shores. I've got Japanese Cherry Blossom, Cotton Candy Clouds, Vanilla Bean Noel, Pure Wonder, Champagne Sprinkles, Snowflakes and Cashmere, Christmas Cookies, or Peach Marshmallow, Candied Violet Sorbet, Sun Washed Citrus in Special Edition Packaging, Into the Night. This is from the Aromatherapy Collection. It's called Air. And then I've got Coconut Cream Pie. So those are my Bath & Body Works shower gels. Okay, so we've got some more Bath & Body Works stuff here. We've got the Winter Peach Marshmallow Body Scrub, Winter Candy Apple Body Scrub, Pink Berry Clouds Body Scrub, Strawberry Pound Cake Body Scrub. This is a Pacifica Crystal Lavender Body Scrub. This is the Dove Exfoliating Body Polish, Crushed Almond and Mango Butter. Dove Exfoliating Body Polish with Pomegranate Seeds and Shea Butter. We've got the Tree Hut Cotton Candy Shea Sugar Scrub. Okay, lots of tree hut body scrubs here. I guess I got two of the cotton candy. We've got pineapple, sugared fantasy, green tea, coconut lime, candied lemon, rock and rose, candy cane, watermelon, tropical mango, margarita citron, Tahitian vanilla bean, desert haze, strawberry, and lavender. Then we've got some miscellaneous body scrubs. Dr. Teal's Shea Sugar Scrub with Black Elderberry with Essential Oils. Trader Joe's Lavender Sea Salt Scrub. Hemp's Fresh Coconut. Hemp's Apricot and Clementine. That sounds really good. The Body Shop Fresh Raspberry. Body Shop Mango. Victoria's Secret Oat Scrub with Oatmeal and Coconut Oil. And Ulta Brightening Vitamin C Body Scrub. 
And then I've got the Olay collection here. So we've got the Exfoliating Moisture Body Wash with Sea Salt. This is Fresh Out Last. I love these Fresh Out Last ones. And this one is Notes of Watermelon and Agave. Fresh Out Last Notes of Calendula and Mango. Fresh Out Last Notes of Star Apple and Hibiscus. Fresh Out Last Notes of White Strawberry and Mint. Out Last Notes of Rose Water and Sweet Nectar. Fresh Out Last Notes of Birch Water and Lavender. So I've got, I think I have them all. <laughs> and Fresh Out Last Notes of Peach and Cherry Blossom. One more. <laughs> fresh Out Last Notes of Pineapple and Coconut Water. Yum. That sounds so good. One more. <laughs> Fresh Out Last Notes of Orchid and Black Currant. Dove Age Embrace Body Cleanser with Peptide Serum. This is kind of a newish line from Dove. I've got the Baked by Melissa Native Body Wash Tie-Dye Vanilla Cupcake. This is fun. I've got the Victoria's Secret Honey Wash with Honey and Shea Butter. Soap and Glory Clean Girls Luxurious Body Wash. Tone Replenishing Body Wash with Island Vibe. Pineapple and Plumeria. This one I think I got at Marshall's. It's the Strawberry Milk Body Cleanser from a K-Beauty brand. Yeah, Marshall's. I've got a couple of these Dial Marula Oil body washes. I think I ordered them from Amazon. The very popular Ulta Beauty Wim Macadamia 3-in-1 Body Wash Bubble Bath and Shampoo. Here we got some more Olay. This is the Eczema Prone Skin Body Wash with Oat Extract. Itchy Dry Skin Instant Relief Body Wash with Aloe Vera. This is from a newer line with Olay. This is the some kind of artist collection. Fearless Artist Series Body Wash with Cocoa Butter and Manuka Honey. Here's a Body Ecology Dark Cherry Orchid 2-in-1 Body Wash Bubble Bath. We've got some OGX here. The Smoothing Coconut and Coffee Scrub and Wash. Hydration Plus Sea Kelp and Hyaluronic Acid Scrub and Wash. And another <laughs> Coconut and Coffee Scrub and Wash. Urban Hydration ones I got at Ulta. This is the Brighten and Glow Peach and Papaya Body Wash, Renew and Restore Vanilla Body Wash, Rejuvenate and Nourish Mango and Lime Body Wash. I've got some Nivea here. This is the Pampering Body Wash with Nourishing Serum, Coconut and Almond Milk, the Refreshing Body Wash with Nourishing Serum, Wild Berries and Hibiscus, and the Refreshing Body Wash with Nourishing Serum, White Peach and Jasmine. Here's some bar soap. I've got these Maja Espana soaps that I bought, I think on FragranceNet. I really haven't used these yet, but it's kind of a classic. I have one bar of zest that must have come with a pack. <laughs> and I've got this five pack of the Kirkland Costco bar soaps. I really like these. They're just basic, but they're really good. I actually use them a lot for washing my um, makeup sponges and brushes too. And then we've got some Dove bars of soap with coconut milk, beauty bar, and a few Bath and Body Works bars of soap that I just picked up recently. This is Fresh Getaway, uh, Champagne Toast, and A Thousand Wishes. Then I've got this um, Duke Cannon Illegally Cut Pine Last Minute Gift Soap. <laughs> it's just a giant bar of pine soap. So, And a couple more body washes. We've got the Soft Soap Juicy Pomegranate and Mango, and we've got the Suave Milk and Honey. And then I've got two of these Olay Moisture Ribbons Plus. One is Shea Plus Lavender Oil. The other is Shea Plus Notes of Peony Blossom. I really like these. I've got the blue one in the shower currently. This is a mess that was in the closet that I need to go through. <laughs> so I'm going to do that now. Um, I've got a lot of skincare stuff here. This is a cleanser. So I'm just going to try and group stuff. This is a gradual tan, but I think it's old. So I'm getting rid of it. Texturizing spray. I think this is old too. I think this Hemp's Star Jasmine and Vanilla body wash is old, unfortunately. This is Shawn Mendes Signature Body Spray. I think this is probably fine. This is a four-in-one body wash that my husband likes, so I'm going to put this in the shower and hope that he uses it. Clarisma Gentle Exfoliating Scrub. I don't remember buying this, but it's probably fine. Beautiful Day Body Lotion. That's pretty old. Shampoo with mango body butter. I think this has sulfates. That's why I threw it in the closet. Yeah, it's got sulfate, unfortunately. I don't use shampoo with sulfate, so I'm going to throw this. Sorry. This is a hair care product for styling. Color saving shampoo, sulfate free. I can use this. Super skinny serum. Some hair serum, I guess. This is a cleansing gel from Peter Thomas Rock. I think I'm going to put the cleansers in here. I think I have a lot of them. Chlorine dry shampoo. Looking at ingredients. 
don't put sulfates or silicones in my hair. I see silica, so I probably won't use this. Gentle cleansing lotion from Neutrogena. Good Molecules. This is a Good Molecules Rose Water Daily Cleansing Gel. This, I believe, is COSRX Low pH Good Morning Gel Cleanser. Why do I have so many facial cleansers? Good grief. Bliss Synergy Toner. I'm actually going to pull this one and start using this one. This is COSRX. I love their products. I think this is going to be good. Curlsmith Double Cream Deep Quencher. This is a really good product. I'm going to put this in the shower now so I don't forget to use it. This is something I just got recently. L'Oreal LV Wonder Water. I haven't tried this. Um... It's a rinse out something. I don't know, but have you tried this stuff? I've heard it's good, but I haven't tried it yet. This is a conditioner. I'm gonna put hair stuff here. This is a facial cleanser from Beekman 1802. Another conditioner, shampoo. This is a toner. Another facial cleanser, another facial cleanser. We have a problem here. This is an ampoule or kind of a serum. Another facial cleanser. This is embarrassing. I'm not sure I'm gonna post this. Dirty Secret Dry Shampoo. Ooh, I love this stuff. I'm going to use this. The COSRX Advanced Snail Peptide Eye Cream. Love it. You guessed it. There's a serum I'm going to try. And then there's my Costco hand soaps. So these are good hand soaps. They're in these nice glass bottles, but these pumps are awful. They just don't work. They keep breaking. The little thing won't pop. So very frustrating. I've looked at videos on how to get the pump to pop, but to no avail. So I have one pump that's working, so I'm just going to have to keep reusing that one. So these things are annoying, but we'll use them up. Thank you so much for joining me today. I really appreciate it. And if you like this type of content, please give it a thumbs up. If you don't, feel free to give it a thumbs down and I'll see you again very soon. Bye-bye.